Anurag, what do you make of this? There is choice. It's just that consumers are just using one browser, right? Yeah, but I, I, to be honest, when I read the news, I was laughing because only a few months ago, uh, Satya went on, you know, with a massive offense with the with the browser wars with his, you know, open AI and um, and then the AI for Bing. And uh, Google's market cap, uh, you know, took a quite a bit of loss in those weeks to follow. And now he's saying that these guys have an advantage even in AI. So it's, it's pretty, pretty uh, amusing to me. I mean, he went on to say that Google could extend their search dominance into an AI Anurag. And that hasn't been the feeling on the day-to-day -day discussion. I mean, as we've said time and time again, this timing of this trial is interesting given the run for its money Google search is getting from generative AI. Yeah, you know, and, and one of the things I talk to a, a lot of investors about is, you know, when you look at something like an Apple, Apple has Apple Maps, and it's pretty crappy, and I've never used it. Um, I still go out and open up an app that has Google Maps in it to do any in navigation. Now, if for whatever reason, if I don't have Google default search on my browser, uh, on my phone, I may be forced to download an app and that I, I can use search that way. At the end of the day, Google search is far better than, than anything else that's out there. And I think that's what Google is, is trying to make a case here.